So let's start with the question, when should you bother debating people on the left? Right? Everybody always thinks, I see a leftist, I'll debate the leftist. Not true. There are only a couple situations in which it is worthwhile to debate somebody who is on the left. One is you found the one honest leftist in America, congratulations. There's only one of them, and he's walking around in Nebraska somewhere. Sometimes he rides a donkey. But aside from that, he's a, you, you, you will not find him, so that's not real. The second time you should debate a leftist is if it's in public. If it's in public and there are other people watching, you should debate a leftist. And these, that's what these tactics are for, right? These tactics are specifically for when you're debating a leftist in public. And the goal of this debate is not to convince the leftist, because leftists are not easily convinced because they operate from the cockles of their small hearts and even tinier brains. So you, the goal here is not to actually convince the leftist, it's to humiliate them as badly as possible in front of as large a number of people as possible. So here is how you actually do that. The reason for that is because politics, unfortunately, and but just realistically, is blood sport. Politics is a game where there are winners and there are losers. It is not just a wonderful discussion where people trade ideas, not anymore. It hasn't been, certainly for my entire adult lifetime. And when I talk to folks who are above the age of 60, they tend to remember a time where politics was a lot more genial, where you could actually have political conversations without people getting in each other's faces and implying that their political opponents were bad human beings. This is no longer the case. The left basically has one argument against all of you, and that one argument is, you're a terrible person. That's the argument, right? I mean, you guys are you're on campuses, you're in high school, you know this, right? When you talk about any issue from the right, the answer is, well, that's because you're a racist, sexist, bigot, homophobe who hates the poor, right? That's always what it comes down to. You're a terrible, horrible human being. 